Hello everyone. I hope your exam went very very well, uh, especially in the science portion. The questions which Ayas sir just discussed, they were very very simple, and uh, I am sure that if you have uh, if you have attended the classes, then you would have easily solved the science questions. Uh, these were lollipops, like you you would have just guessed them and you would have got easy marks. So ten uh, uh, at least ten marks you can get easily. And uh, from general science, we have seen in the last uh, few years, UPSC is focusing more upon biology part. Uh, in the last year also, it has asked one question on biology. This year also, it has asked a similar type of question. It is regarding the B cells and the T cells. Now, why this question was asked? This question was asked because B cells and T cells, they are part of the immune system. So, immune system was in news because of the COVID-19. Last two years, we have last two uh, from 2020 itself, we have seen COVID, that is a big pandemic uh, and immunity was in news. So B cells and T cells are the part of the immune system and they help us to protect from the pathogens. Okay. Now, it is, the question is, if, if you only know this, that B, B and T cells are part of the immune system and they kill the pathogens, uh, they protect us from the pathogens, then you can answer this question. But there is a certain depth to the question. There is a certain depth. Uh, B cell and T cell are a type of white blood cells. Uh, you must have a basic understanding that in our body there is the white blood cells which are uh, immune cells. Okay. Immune cells are of different types. White blood cells are of different types. B cells and T cells, these are the lymphocytes. These are lymphocytes. Uh, they, are, uh, the, uh, they are responsible for acquired immunity. Okay. We have discussed this in the class. Immunity is of two types. One is the adaptive or acquired immunity, one is the innate immunity. Innate immunity is always on in the body. It is not specific to particular anti antigen, that is particular pathogen. And acquired immunity, it is specific to a particular pathogen. So lymphocytes are a part of the acquired immune system and B cells and T cells, they specifically kill the particular pathogen. For example, B cell and T cell, B cell is responsible for and producing antibodies, they produce antibodies. And therefore, B cells are responsible for humoral mediated media, uh, uh, immunity. Humoral means antibody. Now, it is basically in the related to the fluid, blood fluid part. So, B cell uh, produce antibody and they are responsible for antibody mediated immunities. And T cell, they are responsible for uh, <coughs> cell mediated immunity. Okay. So, basically, uh, B cell produce antibodies, these antibodies latch on to the antigens and then other macrophages for example monocytes, these are another type of white blood cells, they come and they destroy the antigen. Okay. On the other hand, T cells come into the picture when the antigen are infecting, when they infect a particular cell. So when a cell is infected, then the T cells play their role. So they uh, kill the cells which are infected and they kill the B cell, they kill the antigen before it has infected the cell. So these two kill the pathogens. Therefore, this is the correct option. Uh, this is another type of white, uh, white blood cells, which is called as acinophil and basophil. Okay, we have covered this in the class. Uh, those of you who have uh, basophil, basophil. Those of you who have attended the class, they must have covered this. Eosinophil and basophil. These are responsible for allergic reactions, and this part is related to the innate immune system. So uh, we have covered this also in the class. So like I said, the question is very simple, but there is a certain depth to it. We have covered it in the class also, and this answer will be D. This is the simple question from general science. Uh, I hope you have done it correctly and I hope I uh, wish you all the best for the other exams also. Thank you everyone. Thank you.